Hi there, Nate Urandi, Orion Training Systems. For those of you who know me, um, when I see an incredible uh, result in the endurance athletic world, I tend to uh, raise an eyebrow at it before I, I trust it. Um, maybe that's my uh, curmudgeon old age kicking in. But in any case, um, case in point is this year's Giro. Uh, Ilnur Zakarin. Um, for those of you who don't know, he's a 26-year-old Russian cyclist on the Katusha team, and he's poised to certainly finish in the top five, if not hit the podium. Tremendous result. Uh, for those of you who don't know his history, uh, he won the, as a 17-year-old, won the time trial at the European tra uh, Road Championships, sorry, not track championships, European Road tra Championships. And then at age 19, got popped for an anabolic steroid, served a two-year ban, came back in 2011 with a continental team, uh, got some okay results at the Tier 2, Tier 3 level of races, finally got a call-up from Katusha, and uh, certainly continued an ascendancy to the point where he won uh, the Tour of Ramadi, which is a seven- or eight-day stage race in April, and... Um, uh, you know, is now, again, poised to land on the podium at the Giro. The only other Grand Tour he's done was last year. Uh, he was 24th at the Giro. Never done the Tour, never done the Vuelta. So we have that one data point. Um, the reason I'm crying foul here is he's Russian. He's part of a system that has just been blown open as far as systematic countrywide doping across a modicum of endurance sports. Uh, unfortunately, cycling being part of that. And so we have to believe that as a teenager, his results were uh, certainly influenced by performance-enhancing drugs. It's not just at age 19 he suddenly decided to start taking some anabolic steroids. So then if we have to disbelieve his uh, results because they're indicative of an athlete being juiced, then how can we think anything differently today when he's again uh, part of the Russian system? Uh, and Kentusha has had some of its own issues as of late. So what I'm getting at is, yes, you could say, well, he's 26, he's getting older, bigger, faster, stronger. Of course he's going to be improving. And that is the case, absolutely. But to look at his trajectory and to... Um, take a 24th at last year's Giro and turn that into a podium spot one year later. Um, when you look at the way he attacks on a mountain stage, such as, such as he did uh, in yesterday's stage, um, I'm smelling a fish. And so um, I leave that I'll leave it with you in that light, let you uh, formulate your own opinions, certainly if you have any comments. Leave them below. Otherwise, as always, happy training.